Today we're going to look at the value you can get from using Google Analytics data right inside Tableau. Let's create a new workbook and connect to our Google Analytics data. Now in Tableau, Google Analytics is just like any other data source. You can find it with your flat files and databases. And accessing that data is as simple as logging in with your Google account. You allow access to that data. And then Tableau gives you the option to go and fetch different measures and dimensions so that you can analyze them with a drag and drop interface. Let me go ahead and get uh, destination page, medium and source, and I'm going to add visits and let's look at time on page as well. When I click OK, Tableau is going to use the Google Analytics API to go out and fetch all that data. Now GA is a very powerful web tracking program, but it doesn't always give you the analytics that you might want, like the ability to blend in new data or make custom dashboards. So those are a couple of the things that we're going to look at today. So now you can see I've got all the information I've requested from GA over here in my dimensions and my measures, and I can simply double click on one of those, for example, visits, and drag out date to see how many visits I've had by day. I'm going to take that down to the day level, and we see a common trend. During the weekdays, we have a lot more visitors than we have on the week weekends. And I can drag out time on page onto the size shelf to see that those visitors are also spending a lot of time. Now this is something simple that you could do in GA right in the interface, so let's look at some of the more advanced things that we might want to do. I'm very interested in what's driving traffic to my website, so I'm going to go ahead and create a new sheet, and I'm going to look at visits and double click on medium to look at visits by medium. Let me sort down and I can swap the rows and col columns. And in Tableau I can even do some ad hoc grouping, for example grouping these fields that are obviously email and perhaps grouping null and none. And I can even create a custom hierarchy with a drag and drop. I can drag source right under medium and now you'll see I can click out anywhere where I have the medium field and click into source and then click it back. Tableau is completely customizable. So let's look at another analysis. I'm going to duplicate this sheet, and one other thing I'm interested in is the destination page that these visitors are going to. So I'm simply going to drag destination page over medium, and again sort down. And I can see that most of these visitors are going to the root public. Now I have three interesting analyses about my website. I'm going to create a new dashboard, and again simply by dragging and dropping, I'm going to create a custom dashboard about my website right in Tableau. And I can give this a title. I'll call it Web Dashboard. Now everything's configurable here from the titles to the, to the legends, but one thing I really want to do is add some interactivity. I'm interested in what's happening on a given day, so I'm going to use my first view, my time trend, as a filter for the other views. And now when I click on some of these peaks, you can see the other views update. And what's interesting is that some of these peaks are driving a lot of traffic to the Visit the Day page. Now, Visit the Day is a program we run sending out one visualization every day to Twitter or email, something that's really brilliant and can catch your eye. And the problem is that we change this visualization at this URL every day, so it's hard to figure out which visualizations are driving a lot of traffic. But we do have a spreadsheet that tells us which visualizations were run on which days. So let's see if we can combine that with our Google Analytics data. Back in Tableau, I'm simply going to connect to data again. And I'm going to choose an Excel file, and I'm going to choose that Visit the Day file we just looked at. And select Sheet 1, and connect Live. Now you can see that that has created a second data source in my workbook. And Tableau has even decided that these two data sources should be joined on date since they have the same field in common. I could customize that, but that is in fact the join that I want. So now I can simply drag out the viz title onto the label for a given day. And now I can click on a peak and I can see what visualization was run on that day. So I'm on the fly combining my Google Analytics data with data in a spreadsheet to help me understand which visualizations are driving traffic. So let me go back to my dashboard, and since I'm using my dashboard as a filter, I can see that this, trend, this visualization, Global Poverty Trends, 
drove a lot of traffic and did in fact drive a lot of traffic to that Biz of the Day site. On the weekend, I'm not running visualization, so nothing shows up. And on some of these other days, I didn't drive quite as much traffic to the visualization. So this is an enormously powerful way to combine web data with other data sources and build custom dashboards to really understand what's going on in your website.